Mr. Tagliatini is the chairman for you. Yes, sir. Is this the king of network programming, Jeffrey Tortellini? S Tagliatini, sir. I've uh, just been going over the ratings, and we're getting killed every Saturday. <laughs> that hurts. Yes, sir. It, it hurts me, too. So, what do we have for next week? Fettuccine, are you there? It's Tagliatini, sir. I was uh, deliberately keeping that new slot open for the new show. Good, good. We, we need something fresh, something, something bold and exciting to really spice up the weekend. So what did you have in mind? Well, um... Well, this may be a little out there for you, sir, but um, I was thinking... Phil Collins. Seriously? Phil Collins? Yes, sir. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, I love it. Yes, sir. Oh, that's great. I'll get right on it, sir. Okay, 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 okay. No, no, no really, who, who do you... Hello? This special presentation is brought to you in part by Labatt's Blue. It's the Pickens Eyes. Let me ask you a question. So, when it's color, it's, it's a fantasy. The color is our reality, and the black and white is Pippin's reality, because they seem like black and white. Now, Pippin is... The dog. Pippin is the dog. He pointed to the dog and said, Pippin... So Pippin's the dog. Now, that was that real food or prop food? Uh, I don't know, George, because I, I, I don't really get much time to eat with the crew anyway, but I guess it's real food. Because it looks great. So that's what the dog sees. This isn't. This is what we see. This is what the dog sees. Oh, I see. So, when it's not fuzzy, that would be... Here we go. You see, this is coming up to her dream sequence. This would be the dream. This would be the dream here, yeah. In right life. in here. Yeah. Now, a dog like that, I'm guessing eats a lot of dry food. Just regular dog food. I don't know quite what it eats. Hmm. It's got a shiny coat. Oh, that's, that's about it. That's about it. Thank you. So basically, that's my idea for the TV special, right? It's life on the road with a rock band, but as seen through the eyes of a dog. And no ordinary dog. This dog, Pippin. A truly phenomenal dog. We could even give the dog a voice. You know, like that film uh, about the baby, you know, the uh, Bruce Willis film, you know? Oh, right. So this would be sort of a look who's barking. Exactly, yeah. exactly. That's, that's a clever idea, Phil. Hmm. Yeah. See, that, and the film clip is just it's very funny. I was crying. I thought I dropped dead. I thought I'd have a seizure. It was funny. Yeah. Pippin and I, we can start straight away. There's really no problem with time. Yeah, yeah. Phil, Phil. You see, I'm sure I'm not the first one to tell you this, but you see, rock and roll music and primetime TV, it's a, a tough sell. Everyone knows that. It doesn't Oil sell. It doesn't sell. Water. The two don't go together. Right. It's not that I don't like your music because it, uh, I, I'm a big fan. It's, it's great. Oh, it's most great. of it. I love it. The last album was kind of weak really and good. derivative, I but most it. of it's good. And I'm the one who chose uh, One More Night for our uh, summer rerun campaign. How's that go? One more night. See it just one more night. night. Could I ask you to do a little of that for us? One more night. Thanks for coming in, Phil. My door is always open to you. Hmm. Come on, Pippin. Pippin, could you stay behind one second? Get rid of him. He's a bozo. You're a star. We have a show for you. Pippin! Pippin! 
Get off the couch. Get off the couch. Well, how many times have I told you not to sleep on my couch? You leave hairs everywhere. Hey, Phil, babe. At least I have hair to leave places. Yeah, don't you growl at me or you'll be back on the roadies bus. Yeah. You know, I'm beginning to regret I ever asked you to do that video. It's really gone to your head. I'm expecting some very important guests. So behave, right? You mean Mr. Pierre is coming by for your little hair treatment? Come in. Some fellas who say they're from the network are here to see you, Phil. Sure, bring him in. You're not Phil. <laughs> Phil's an older man. You're a teenager. Look at you. Yeah, thank you Rachel. Right. Hello, Rachel. Rachel. George. Hello, George. That's nice George. Me. Yeah, we met. What a cute dog. Is it yours? Adorable. She's really a tour mascot. You know, we used her on a video for one of my songs. Something happened on the way to heaven. It's on TV now. You seen it? No, no, we haven't. But we, we barely have time to breathe. We haven't been breathing. We have not been breathing. JT feels terrible that he can't be here right now with you, but quite frankly, somebody more important was in town. He, he means more important in a half hour episodic sense, not, not in the sense of the meaning that we're having here now. Mind you, not more talented and not younger than you, but just uh, more important in a certain sense. Phil, sound check five minutes. Uh, I forgot. Look, get uh, Chester and the horn players started and I'll be over as soon as I finish it. We have an idea. And first of all, you must have lost 50 pounds. Look at you, you're terrific. We have an idea. You should do your own network special. And you know what? You have control over it. We're not here. We're invisible. We're not in the room. It's your special. Well, I'm very, very flattered, you know. But uh, I always thought that um, rock and roll didn't really translate on television, you know. And I'm only a drummer that sings, after all. Oh, I just hate it when he pulls that false modesty bit. Did you hear that? I'm only a drummer who sings a little bit. Is there any question why I love him? Do you doubt why I love him? Only a drummer who sings a little bit, and Will Chamberlain is just tall for his age. You are a big star. Look, Live Aid and Nebworth, they were full of big stars. They weren't on primetime television either. You know why? They can't get the ratings that you can. You want ratings? Do a special with Pippin there. She was great in the video. You know, sometimes you just gotta love that little guy. A dog act? You want an animal in a special? That's the kiss of death. It's the kiss of death. It's like, I'm dead here. Mwah! This cat is starting to remind me more and more of a fire hydrant. Well, I would be happy to have a go at a show that I just played and sang, you know? You mean rock and roll? Well, wait a second. Wait a second. We're not married to rock and roll here. Um, wait, I'm brainstorming. I'm brain... There's a flood going on. Wait, there's a flood. The electrical wires are down. Oh, my God, what's happening here? Prime time. Broader demographic skew. Major sponsors. Big band. Big, big band? It's perfect. Yeah, I mean, I like the old songs, you know, but I don't know about doing them for a whole show. Who said a whole show? Did, did I say a whole show? Did any of them say a whole show? No one said a whole show. We want you to do your songs. This way, you do your songs, but in a big band style. We have them both in one package. All right, all right. So let's try one song. Make a test, right?
Come on now, come on, fight the guy. Don? Yeah, hello. Jeffrey Tagliatini. How are you? Uh, good. How did you get this number? Never mind about that now, oh, Don. Listen, I, I got a problem, and you're the only one who might be able to help me. Yeah, uh, what? Well, I'm trying to do a network special with Phil Collins. Seriously? Phil Collins? Oh, yeah, he's a pal of mine. Great guy, did a Miami Vice together. So, uh, what do you want? We're having problems coming up with the right approach. They have the guy sing and play, that's what I'd like to see. I, I, I don't think that'll do it. Don, the reason I'm calling you is... Oh, Don, you're big. You're very big. You're very, very, very big. Yeah, right, I'm big. What do you want? I, I need you to do a guest shot with us on the Phil Collins show. And you're the only one I'm asking. Uh, well, uh, gee, Jeffrey, uh, I'm kind of busy right now, at least from, through 1995. Uh, if you can wait till then, I'll be glad to. Cameo? Impossible. Yeah, yeah, I'll be right with you. Uh, listen, Jeffrey, I gotta go test my race boat. Uh, tell Phil I said hi, will you? Yeah, good talking to you. This guy calls back, tell him I drowned. It's really not right for this project. Not really. Yeah. Phil Collins Online 4, sir. Phil. How are you? How's Miami? Great. Yeah. No, you're absolutely right about that big band thing. It's wrong. Yeah, but I felt really bad, you know, because it was Henry Mancini. I mean, yeah, I mean, he was great, you know. No, it just, just wasn't working. Now, don't worry about it. Enough said. It's history. It's over. Phil, listen to me. I've been thinking. We need something on the cutting edge of the 90s. Uh, and what does that mean exactly? Rap. 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 First thing you gotta do, first thing you gotta do, first, first yeah. thing you gotta do, boy, <laughs> turn your hat around like this. Studio. Whoa, -ho. whoa, -ho. Phil. Hey, John Candy. Hi, John. How are you? I'm fine. Good, good, good. Yeah, I, I heard you were in town. Yeah, you're you're working on a TV special, huh? Well, you know, we're talking about it mainly. What about you? Me? 
I don't know if you know this or not, I bought a studio. Yeah. Not, not studio. <laughs> studio, studio. Joke, thank you. Never mind. I was thinking, you know, for an image change for me, maybe if I got into music, you know, that might be the... The kick I need. I, I, I put an album together. Singing. Really? You sing, huh? <clears throat> oh, yeah, the whole thing. I, I had a band in here, uh, you know, I got one of those Casios, one of those little, um, little things. I got it for about $100. So that was all the music, and uh, I got some guy to operate it for me. Actually, you got quite a sound out of it. Really? Uh-huh. Well, I heard you've got this special. God, this is a bad line. Can you hear me? Phil? John? You going through the canyons now? Well, this, no, this is a bad line. Phil? If I could do your show to kind of kick off my album. Uh, John, look. John, look, I'm in a bit of a hurry now, because I've got to go to a sound check. Th Phil? I'll have to call you back, all right? Oh, I hate these car phones. Yes. Bruce, Jeffrey Tagliatini, how are you? Good. How'd you get this number? Never mind that now, Bruce. Listen, I got a problem, and you are the only one I know who might be able to help me. Yeah, what? I'm trying to do a network special with Phil Collins. Seriously? Phil Collins? Yes, I know Phil. He's a friend of mine. He's a great guy. What do you want? Well, we're having problems coming up with the, with the right approach. Just have the guy sing and play. That's what I want to see. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure that's going to work. Uh, I'm calling you, Bruce, because you're big. You're very big. You're very, very big. Yes, I'm big. What do you want? I need you to do a guest shot with us on the Phil Collins show. You're the only one I'm asking. Well, I'd love to, but I'm busy through 1995. If I can wait till then, I'd be glad to do it. Cameo. Impossible. I'll be right there. Look, I'm sorry, Jeff. I got to get back to the set. Just tell Phil I said hello, OK? Bye. He's not really right for this project. Not really. Where's Phil headed next? Nashville's here. Nashville. You have no right to ask me how I feel. You have no right to speak to me so. So for now, we'll go on living separate lives. Sing it, Bobby. Well, I held on to I mean, really, it's just, see, I accepted, and it's wonderful, you know, the barn and, 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 and the saddle and, and that beautiful horse, Pappy. I mean, and this cute, lovely outfit. Just nice, isn't it? wonderful, Phil. Yeah. <laughs> but what were you trying to do? Were you trying to yodel? I mean, I don't think that I or this horse can deal with that much cowboy, really, in this song. I just, 
I can't do this, Jim. I mean, I really can't. I love you. I'm your biggest fan, but I can't stand that. <laughs> I, I didn't think it was that bad, Jim. I think I could, I think I could get into it. Jim? Okay, okay, you were wrong about the country music. You were wrong. You tried it, and you were, you're human, you were a little wrong, right? No kidding, he looked like a Christmas tree in Costa Rica. It's just that, you know, I think we just strayed that little bit too far, Roger. The demographics for country are usually pretty good. Well, you know something? We need a middle ground. Not too much this way, not too much that way. Right in the middle. Um, let's... You know what would be good for you? Who was that guy? He was a, a singer and he couldn't act. Um, Elvis. Everybody loves Elvis. Yeah, remember when Elvis came back to TV and it just, okay, he was fat. He was really fat. You're not uh, even close to how fat he was. I mean, you're a little, but not, you could wear a big jacket. Uh, alone on stage. All, well, he was the stage. Alone on stage. A man and his music. One more night, one more night, one more night. Ooh, oh, oh. one more night, one more night, one more night. I've been trying oh so long to let you know that you know how I feel. Oh, if I stumble or if I fall, just tell me back so I can make you see. Just give me one more night. Just give me one more night. One more night. Mm -hmm. oh, oh. Just a one more night. One more night. Jim, Jim, I, I, I don't feel very comfortable doing this, Jim. Jim, no, I don't really, I don't, I'm very happy with it, Jim. Really. John, Jeffrey Tagliatini, how are you? Good. H how did you get this number? Uh, never mind that now, John. Listen, I got a problem. You're the only person I know who might be able to help me. Oh yeah, what is it? I'm trying to do a network special with Phil Collins. Seriously, Phil Collins? Well, I know Phil. He's a, he's a friend of mine. He's a great guy. What, what, what do you want? Yeah, we're having <laughs> problems coming up with the right approach. Well, just have the guy sing and play. That's, that's what I'd want to see. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure that's going to work. Now, I'm calling you, John, because you're big. You're very big. You're very, very big. <laughs> you're implying that I've gained weight. <laughs> We need you to do a guest shot with us on the Phil Collins show. I mean, you're the only one I'm asking. I'm very busy right through through 95. I mean, if you can wait till 95, I'd be thrilled to do it. Cameo? No, I'm sorry. It's impossible. Look, look uh, I, I, I've got to go. I've, I've got dinner guests coming. I, I'm sorry. Hey, listen, tell Phil I said hi, all right? Thanks for calling. That's the whole idea. You see, it's a time machine. It transports Phil Collins and his band back to the year 1912. An ocean liner steaming across the Atlantic. You mean like the Titanic? Yeah, we call it uh, the SS Udio. <laughs> wait, 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 are they going to look out of place on a boat like that? That's the whole point, don't you see it? You see, Phil Collins and the band are going to be in color. Mm -hmm. The rest of the ship Black and white. Black and white. Give it that lush, big screen look. Exactly. And uh, you have, like, uh, Phil, he's like one of the acts on the ship. But, along with the magician, jugglers. Or a guy that plays the spoons. Love him, don't you love him? Our dear friend Jack Spoon's there, a real favourite on our floating house of fun. A hard act to follow here, you say? Yes, indeed, ladies and gentlemen, a hard act to follow. But don't forget, variety is the key when you're sailing the sea on the SS Udio. So, by way of a treat, here for the first time on land, 
Orsi, it's Phil Collins and his Galloping Horses Review! People back then didn't like that kind of music. That's the whole point. They hate that kind of music. Phil goes back in time and they hate what he's playing. But gradually, he wins them over. You never thought you'd ever get a chance. You never thought your friend would come along. That doesn't sound very interesting. No. Oh, here's the interesting part about it. You see, they're playing way too loud. Yeah, Phil realizes this, and, and he tells him to keep it down. Why does Phil tell them to turn down? Here, here, here's why. You see, because they're playing really loud, and all the pictures on the wall are shaking, and the paint is peeling, and then all of a sudden they realize that the music's so loud, it's hurting the structure of the ship. Well, they let you out. Well, then pull you in. Playing every your emotions. You feel like giving in. Yeah. Hang on. Because the ship sinks. The ship, ship sinks? sinks? Uh, isn't that a bit too depressing? You know, you're probably right. We'll uh, put on a funny ending. I hear you have none. Guys, I told you, you was playing too loud. Well, it sounds like a music video to me. Look, I think we're drawing a blank, guys. Excuse me, Phil, did Pip and the dog appear in that lifeboat at all? Phil, sound check. Oh, I forgot. Look, I've got to get you ready for sound check, guys. I'm sorry. Um, if we don't get this thing nailed pretty soon, you know, we're going to have to forget about it. Don't say forget it. Don't say forget it. Please, sorry, JT's but... coming in. Don't say, please, I'd sooner go home and kill my family than have you forget it. Forget please, it. I love you, Phil. Rachel loves you. Mm -hmm. George loves you. Enjoy the show. Get him a few tickets. Right? Hello. Phil John Candy here. How you doing? Good. How's the special going? Can, can you can you hang on a minute? Yeah. Oh, it's John Candy. I think he's heard about this TV special. Now he wants to see me. What am I going to do? Just put him on hold and I'll come back and deal with it. All right. Phil? Hey, Phil! You remember I called you last week uh, about my solo album? 
Fabulous idea, John. I'm moving ahead from that. I, I think that my solo career is over. Over? I've got a better idea now. Super groups. Super groups? Yeah, super groups. All the big bands. Uh, we get me and you and, and you know, Andy Williams, Zamfir, Ginger Baker, and Motorhead, and we go, we go on the road. Yeah, we get a we get a bus and we just travel. Zamfir, Zamfir, the, the, the guy who plays the, uh, the 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 pan pipes there. Yeah, I love that the guy. pan pipes. Oh, he's very big internationally, and of course, Motorhead for the kids. But that's not. Look, here's another combination. If you don't like that one, here, how about this one? Me, you, Julio Iglesias, uh, Slim Whitman, Roger Whitaker, and Motorhead. Can you imagine the laughs we'd have? I love it. Huh? Oh, that'd be a scream. Yeah, I love it. Fabulous idea, John. <laughs> Phil. You're breaking up there. Buddy? Hey, Phil? Call me back then. <laughs> All right. I think this is since it. Phil? Are you. I hate car phones. Gee. Shirley Bassey. Yeah. Phil Collins. Goldfinger. That could work. I wish I could just make a turn around. Turn around and see me cry There's so much I need to say to you So many reasons why You're the only one who really knew me at all Take a look at me now I still stand here You know something? I think all this time you two have been wrong. I mean, it, it, it's like, it, it's sometimes less is more. Sometimes a little bit is a lot. Sometimes a tiny bit is a gigantic bit. It, it, it's like, it's like with all the problems around, it's like the lyrics are what counts. Look at the problems in the world, the homeless, the environment. People are less selfish and more socially conscious now. Yeah. Don't you hate that? She calls out to the man on the street. Sir, can you help me? It's cold and I've nowhere to sleep. There's somewhere you can tell me. It's like the sick all of a sudden with that annoying it's like a whole Joan Baez thing that's it politically conscious these things mean we can eat backstage? Oh, how selfish of me. I forgot when you were choking on that popcorn that you didn't eat for a second and a half. Wait, we'll go backstage. Maybe they're cooking up something like a horse or a zebra. Oh, there must be something you can say. Special guest Drew Barrymore coming out on Shamu, the killer whale. And then we get, I don't know who's ever the current black athlete. 
and then we get like Miss America. Vanessa Williams? Nah, she'd never do it. I didn't she think so. Point. Wrestling, wrestling always. Wrestling. Got, got a point. Mm -hmm. Yes. Rock and wrestling. And a bunch of midgets. No, you don't even. You need the champ. You need the, the champ, champ wrestling. Hulk Hogan. No, he's not the champ. Who is it? Uh, uh, Ultimate Warrior. Ultimate Warrior. Phil Collins and the gorgeous ladies of wrestling. A bunch of spandex-clad, sweating husky I women. I got it. Phil Collins versus the Ultimate Warrior. <laughs> with a stupid idea. You have any more moronic suggestions? Great. Concert starting and we're lost.
was right all along. Maybe we should forget all these other ideas. Phil is a great singer, a great musician. Maybe our network should take a chance, go out on a limb, boldly go where no network has ever successfully gone before. Yes. Let's put Phil on the network in prime time. No, you can't do that. If you, if you just put Phil on stage and you film it, then we, we have no reason to be here. We're the network. We're the idea people. We'll be... You're right. Let's get some t-shirts for the kids and get out of here. What do you say? Hey, 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 what, what, what about my show? Hey, what's going on? I, I thought we had a deal here, I, I, an understanding, a, a relationship. It, it was personal. Uh, well, what about at least some development money? Uh, I'll have my people call your people. Uh, they can do lunch and, and, and I'll cover the whole thing. John Candy. Well, that uh, first album I did, somebody really liked it and asked me to go on tour with him. Johnny Rotten from the Sex Pistols, he loved it. The guy's been sending me flowers and guitars. Uh, Are you guys packed up in there yet? No! Yeah. I, I, I don't know, it seems odd to me too, but uh, what the heck, you know, anything to get in the music business. So uh, we, we leave next week and I, I got so much to do this week. I, I gotta go to today to get a face tattoo. I can't believe it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm getting some, some webbing or something, like a spider's web on my face. And then they're going to do something with my ears. They're going to tie them back and, and, and connect it to, to my butt, I think. Some, some chain or something. It, I don't know what it is, but uh, Johnny's got it all figured out. And, uh, you know, he's the leader of the band. <laughs> Phil? Phil? Must have switched to a car phone. Hmm. Yeah. Mr. Tagliatini, it's the chairman for you. Yes, sir. Tetrazzini! What did you come up with for Saturday night? We, we, we filmed the Phil Collins special that you wanted. Ah, I told you I hate that! Oh, well, uh... Sir, um... This is gonna be way out for you, but have you ever heard of a dog named Pippin? Ooh! <laughs> what was that? Pippin. Oh, yeah! Yeah. Oh, now there you go. Yes, sir. Ah. I'll get right on it, sir. Oh. Serious, serious. Serious, serious. Presentation was brought.